What's up guys, Dan here, and today I have a Yu-Gi-Oh! Mega Tins 2017. Now, yes, these tins are pretty cool. Uh, of course, they've uh, kind of like done the same thing as last year with the Yu-Gi-Oh! and Kaiba kind of designs. Um, except this time the promos are pretty different. They're not so much based around them, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Kaiba. They have the new Link Monster, which is Proxy Dragon, Pot of Desires and Ultra Rare reprint, which is pretty good. And of course, you have Dark Magician and Blue Eyes, White Dragon in Secret Rare Art. Uh, Secret of Rarity, sorry. And the art form is, um, I believe the Yugi one, uh, the Dark Magician one is from the recent structure deck, and the Kaiba one is the Legend of Blue Eyes artwork. And if you don't know what that is, I can show you, obviously. Uh, here they are. All sealed in one, like, wrapping. Wow, it's like a cling film, almost. Uh, did you... This time there's no like artwork on it, it's just I mean, um, colour on it, it's just silver. So, yeah, this is the Dark Magician, pretty cool. Um, limited edition, of course, as all these promos are. Uh, Proxy Dragon, so yeah, they kept the rarity thing on the promos, I believe. I don't think they've done it on the Mega Pack stuff, so yeah, Proxy Dragon, Part of Desires, number 71 Rebarian Shark or Rebarian Shark. Dreamland, and a token, of course, of which the artwork is related to the tin. So, yeah, pretty cool. Um, Proxy Dragon and Pop Desires are probably the better competitive promos. The other ones are kind of just like, meh, I guess. But anyway, let's get into the pack. So, I think probably most people have known what's in this tin already. There's been a lot of, like, uh, previews already, and some people have managed to get the tins a little bit earlier. But, yeah, let's get through these. Angel Trumpeteer, Despot 009, right, uh, Rise to Full Height. Graceful tier. Let's get through these commons. Uh, super Heavy Samurai Soul Peacemaker. Preparation, alright, so very good super reprint. Block Dragon, an ultra reprint, and a totally awesome, so cool. A secret rare. Um, I'm not sure how to do this, but yeah, some of the um, the reprints in this are okay. Um, but yeah, I think the majority are going to be like good, uh, the ones that are going to be good are secrets because yeah, with these like new main sets changing around, it's kind of like change the way obviously rarities are now like kind of perceived as being valuable or not but anyway beacon of white bad aim red mirror the kaiju files ray raptor avenge vulture assault blackwing anyway a rare is ten men uh, timatai uh pays oak abenia uh the white stone of agents ultra rare reprint very nice it's a good one and a foolish bearer of goods awesome so yeah there's no um hollow on the the attributes or the name of the card uh, the name of the type of card or whatever it is. You know what I mean. If it's a monster, it's the attribute. If it's a spell and trap, it will say spell and trap. And of course the uh, levels or uh, attribute, uh, not attributes, levels or ranks, that's the one for the uh, monsters. Cuban, Bugget Matrix, Raid Raptor again, is Cell, uh, Cell Shell <laughs> Crab, Adonis Spinos, Raid Raptor, blah blah. Uh, high Speed Roy Puzzle, uh, Metamorphomation, Pretty cool. Uh, True King Barastos, the, the water one basically, that's pretty cool. And a Magician Navigation, awesome. So these are probably one of the good reprints of the set. Um, actually, I don't know why I put the Foolish Barrels there. So yeah, this is probably one of the better reprints of the set. I've actually messed this up completely now. Uh, never mind. But yeah. Um, yeah. Magician Navigation, I believe Dark Magical Circle as well, um, and Blue Eyes Twin Burst Dragon, so probably the more collectible ones, I guess. Um, and yeah, now for the Kyber Tin. It's actually a pretty cool design, I actually forgot to show you. Actually, the, the Yugi one has a Millennium Puzzle box, uh, puzzle on the bottom, so it's quite, an, it's actually really nice. I think the tins are definitely um, look a lot nicer than last year's. And same again with this cling film type wrapping. It's like super thin. And there we go, a Blue Eyes White Dragon Secret Rare from Legend of Blue Eyes, of course. I think it's the exact same, well, it's obviously not the exact same because it's got the, the stars and attributes, but um, it's the one from the tin, I think, the first tins that, that came up in Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, I put that on, well, I don't know where I put this now, put it over there. Uh, Proxy Dragon, Pot of Desires, of course, again, and Sanifod, the Sky Prison, so these are the different uh, promos that are super. So yeah, this is the another number card, so good for number collectors. Elder Entity Ints, um, 
yeah, for, I believe, Infernoids and, of course, the token as well. So, I've enough of that, I guess. I mean, let's move on to the packs. Uh, Sour Shell Crab again. I think we've been through a lot of these already. Oh, Dark Magic Expander, that's cool. Uh, Super uh, Anti Kaiju War Machine Mecha Dogaran. Uh, Priestess of Wiser Blue, that's a all right reprint. Ah, Shiranui Solitaire, very, very nice, good reprint. And a Never Foolish Barrel of Goods. So, yeah, I think like majority of the good stuff will come from the secrets, of course. Um, yeah, some more cards. Oh, Howitzer. Uh, and yeah, that's um, pretty much it, I'd say. There's a few Ultras and a few Supers, but it's mainly the secrets, of course. Um, let's get through these. Spiritual Beast uh, Tamer Winder, the Phantom Knight's Rank Up Magic Launch, a Stardust Sephir Divine Dragon, so that's actually an alright secret rare, and a uh, ultra rare, and a totally awesome secret rare. Nice. So, we've had two of each, um, totally awesome, and of course, some uh, foolish pair of goods. So, last pack of these double tin openings. Of course, Mausoleum of White, Zodiac Whiptail, Zodiac Fire of Blade, okay, and a Drowning Mirror Force, that's alright. So yeah, no um, Dark Magical Circle in this, and unfortunately, no Blue Eyes Twin Burst, but never mind. But anyway, thanks guys for watching. Oh, actually, I forgot to mention, if you actually want to check out my eBay shop, links in the description below. Actually, I'll be selling a lot of these tins and the promos, and I'll also be selling cases of tins, so you'll get um, six of each Kyber and Yugi tin in a sealed case. And I'm selling that probably soon, but that'll probably be on a second account that I have for bulk selling. So anyway, thanks guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys in a future video.